<laughs> Hello everyone. Hi. As you can see, we're in tank tops because it is just awful hot. Like awful hot, you start to melt. I tried to do an ice, cu ice cube outside and it melted in two minutes and it's 5 p.m. Might be a little bit of exaggeration. Um, welcome to, this is episode, this is workout number five, four? Four, four or five. We have so much fun we don't even remember. Um, it's hot, so uh, we're going to keep this nice, short, and cool. A lot of you are lucky that you get to be inside. Um, but today we're going to work on a little bit what we did last week with the touches. Um, and then we're also going to do a little bit more, a little bit more cardio in this lovely box here. And then we're going to end with a little bit more... Um, fun so again you need your four objects um you want to say how your week went or something no my week was great how hot is it here uh yeah the last three days are it's, yeah it's gonna it's really hot here so it's like 30 degrees um, it feels like 48 but is that possible in celsius yeah let's start some work i'll be in the shade most of the time so all you need to know is my voice and she's the one, I'll give her a massage later, to pay for her work today. So, last week, and if you guys have noticed, we actually do not have the, the Global Goals World Cup ball because um, our neighbors, is that you hear a lot, the little kids, they did not have a soccer ball. So, um, we kind of told them about it and they got really excited. Um, but Mike is sending us a new one, which I appreciate it, um, because we think it's a pretty cool thing and it... It has a bit more meaning than our um, Puma Puma ball here. So, with that being said, um, last week we worked on right one one two two three three four four. So, if you guys got better and you worked on that, write down what you got. If you could get up to eight and down or ten and down, I want to know because it's it's good to see the week progress, right? So, I have the challenge of a little ball today to demonstrate. So remember, it's just one one. One, two, one, two. Okay. Yeah? Okay. Today, we're going to work a little bit on different heights. All right? So, again, this is just a warm-up. So, instead of going, and you can do either foot, it doesn't matter. Okay? But you're going to try to do four juggles. We'll stick to our four. Four juggles under your knees. Four juggles above your knees. So, Fox is really good at her technique over her knees. And I'm very good at under my knees, okay? So, what you wanna do, again, we wanna try to bring it from the floor. And it's just one, two, okay? One, two, three, four. Start with just that, okay? Just nice and easy, four. If you can't pick it up from the bottom, this is just a really easy pickup, you're just pulling it back, then feel free to just go but your goal is to stay around or underneath your knees. I'm gonna come right next to you and practice with my little ball here. Okay, so just try to do that, right? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There we go. One, two, three, four. Try to do this number five times okay one two three four now once you've got that we'll try to go higher so this time the four juggles are going to be above above your knee so two. yep I just demonstrated with my hand okay about your knee okay so now you want to think of the ball between your knee and your head. Not over your head, okay? And you can see Box is just dropping it nice and easy, but her technique is keeping it so it's below her head and above her knees. Now, if it's on the borderline, it doesn't matter. It's okay, right? Yep, D, good. Give it a try, okay? Two, three, and thank you, Mike, and we appreciate it, okay? So now, we're gonna do the four and four. So now in football, your touch is all about different heights, right? So your goal now is to go one, two, three, four, 
One, two, three, four. Ha! Okay? So do four little and four above your knee and catch. Perfect. Now, if you need to do five or six, it's okay. The important thing is more just about going from low and high. So if you do three and then go high and down, it's fine. So we'll give you one minute here. We'll try to go from low to high. When you go from low to high, it's one. So keep going from low to high, low to high, low to high. Good. Good, and just keep counting yours when you go low to high. Give you another 30 seconds. Keep going, 30 seconds. Okay. I'm gonna try two. Okay, yeah. So I give you a little ball. Oh, good job. That's two for me. Another 10 seconds. Good. And pause. Okay? So you should be somewhat warm. And you can just play with that as you go, right? The different heights. Again, the technique. Try to have the no spin. Okay? Try to have just a nice and easy... Okay, that's what you want to work on, just going different heights. Now, a little bit more warm, we're going to go in the box. Okay, so you can put the ball to the side. And again, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, 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 three. You guys can be upset with me later, okay? Um, we're going to work on just, on just movement for a footballer. Okay, so when you're doing a footballer and you're playing, it's really important to be on the balls of your feet. So we're gonna number it like usual. One, One. Two, two, three, three. Four. four. Oh, you did the opposite. One, two, so Bob did it. We're gonna do Bob's this way. So One, two, One, two three. three, four. Okay, so you got it. One, two, three, four. Real quick, you'll do 10 seconds or so. You'll be on the balls of your feet, quick feet. As I say, number, you go to the cone. So really easy. Get ready, go on your quick feet. One. Good. Two. Three. Four. <laughs> this is why I get to be the coach. Okay, so you notice how she changed it, yeah? So, one. going in that circle all right and you notice boss what she's doing when she goes to the cone she's going to touch it with your hand just make sure that you guys get there or whatever object that you have now we're going to add in some twist so if i say a we're going to let bops choose the exercise so if i say a what are you going to do okay a lunge jump this is boss's choosing don't be mad at me now okay b Oof. B's a little push-up here. Mm -hmm. And C. C. Okay, so we'll go through it so. So when I say go, you're going to do 30 seconds of work. Okay, I won't cheat you here. Okay, when I say same thing, you go one, two, three, four. But when I say A, you have to do A. A again is the squat jump or the split jumps. When I say B, in the middle, you have to do good old burpee. Then when I say C, it's two tuck jumps. All right, so we're gonna get you guys nice and warm today. Bops especially. Okay, we're starting 10 seconds. 10. And get ready, set, go. Two. Three. A. Four. One. C. 
Good. Two. One. B. Sorry about that one. A. A. C. Good, and rest. Okay? So you, you get this. This is um hard. Now I'm going to go to give Bops a rest. Be nice. I get a little sweat in. So you guys can come with me. A is right. B. I'm not going to do the push-up. I just go down. Yeah, this way. And C. Just regular jumps for me. <laughs> Can't do the tucks. The belly gets in the way these days. You're doing 30 seconds. Yeah. And go. One. One. Eight. Four. <laughs> Three. Two. C. Jump. A. <laughs> B. Last one, three. And time. It's harder than it looks. Okay? Now you get another 30 second rest. Mm -hmm. Do one more. Then you guys should be getting ready to go. And you can see, when I say it's hot, it's hot. Okay? So, last one here. Then we'll go for some little bit of ball work. Okay? To catch my breath. Okay. okay, ready? 30 seconds and go. Four, two, one, one, A, B. Good. Three. Two, one, C, A, B, C. Good, and stop. Well done. You guys deserve water. And for the cones, you're gonna take number four here and you're gonna put it right between one and two in the middle and you keep the distance of the box so this is in the same exact back part i'm just walking it right behind three so it looks like a t same distance about four between each cone but now the important is these three are in the same lines all right so now we're going to be working on our touch doing some figure eights so we'll start with your right foot now watch Bops here first, okay? Because it's kind of hard to explain. Whatever side you go to first, you go on the opposite side of the middle. So go her right foot, she goes around. Doesn't matter how. Come, figure eight. Come back, figure eight. Then she goes around it and comes back. So then she, exactly when she's done, stay on that side. She's on the next side, right? So when she comes on this side, she here, she goes around. Okay, comes around again. Then as she goes, I think always in the eight. You come on this side. So you should end on the opposite side. Does that make sense? Yeah. So fine. you figure out. So we'll go right and easy with your right foot. Just trying to get as many touches as possible. Okay. And ready? Go. Nice and easy round, figure eight. Good. I think you did extra. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so she, now she'll end on the left side. Okay? Bops did an extra one. So it doesn't really matter. As long as you go and you end up, we'll change it. It's fine. She'll go left foot now. Ready? Go. Comes around. Around. And then back the other side. Perfect. Okay? And we'll do it one more time. Okay, same exact thing. And go, as many touches as possible. Good. You. <laughs> Good. 
Okay, so she's, the side, she's heat stroke. She always does an extra turn, right? Okay, so try your left. Go. Figure eight, nice and easy. Good. Comes back. There, her left side's perfect. Imagine that. Okay, take a rest. Now, the thing about what you're gonna do is you're gonna have to watch me, okay? So I'm gonna have my hands here on your screen, if you can see them. If not, just pretend like you're looking up because in football it's important that you not only look forward, but you're checking all points. So when Bob's comes here and around, she's gonna have to inward look, she's always gonna have to look at me, right? Comes here, look, she always have to check what's around you. That makes sense? So you have to check my numbers, okay? Right foot again. Ready? And go. Two. Four. Three. Good. Perfect. Rest. Go with your left foot now. And go. Two. Three. Perfect, okay? Now same thing, but we'll do the insides. Same exact pattern, right? First two we'll just do for fun. You're just gonna try to go as fast as you can. So your goal is to beat Bob's, okay? So it's just here. You can stay looking down. Okay, same thing, go around figure eight. You don't have to worry about me. Just get your flow. Okay, the first one will go slow. The next one you compete with Bob's. And ready? Start right and go. Good. Perfect. Good. Okay. Now, your goal is to beat Bob, so you're going to try to go as fast as you can. Ready? Ready. Set. Go. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Try to get as many touches as you can. Good, good, good. Perfect. If, you've, if you beat her, you gotta let me know, right? Make sure you comment on this, on this thing, all right? Now, this isn't about speed, but you're gonna do it backwards, okay? So you're gonna be coming this way. Your goal is to do the same pattern but move the ball backwards. When you move it backwards, you kind of want to think about making your feet a big a bit of a triangle and really pull it backwards with you, okay? First time, you'll go nice and slow. Second time, you'll try to beat Bob's. I don't know if she, have you ever done this in your life? Backwards figure eight? All right, she said no. And go. Perfect. Good. It's hard with the change of direction. Stay with it, stay with it. Perfect. Good job. All right. How's your calves? Burning a bit? Really? Okay. We're gonna go again. Now your goal is to beat Bob's. Again, you have to stay facing backwards. And Go. Good job. Keep going. Good so. Good so. Good. And rest. Perfect. Okay. Rest in the shade. We'll take you later. She says her feet are burning because it's so hot. All right. So next one. It's all about rolls. And every time you change, you hit a cone, you're gonna change feet, all right? So you can start facing this way or this way, it doesn't matter really. So what you're gonna do is you're just rolling it. So the ball seeing when I hit a cone, I go to another side. When I hit a cone, go to another side. And we're all doing that same type of pattern. The pattern doesn't change, right? But the thing I'm using the most is the bottom of my foot. So if you start with your right foot, you should end with your left foot because every time you hit a cone, you should be changing your feet. 
your foot, your feet, your foot. All right, first one nice and easy here. Just get your flow and go. Good. It's okay, if you mess up, work on the change of direction, right? It's not easy. Good. Perfect. Okay, <clears throat> we're gonna give this one more go. Okay, then we'll try to go faster. And go. Good. Keep your figure eight, good. Perfect. That's how you know you do it right. It's if you start with one foot and then you end with another. Now, listen, this last one, when we go as fast as you can, okay, you should mess up. Why should you mess up? It's because you're pushing your body to limits, right? So try to go as fast as you can. If you mess up, get the ball and try again. It doesn't matter, all right? Goals to be bops. Ready, set, go. Good. Pace, 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 good. Okay, good, get it. Perfect. Perfect, okay. Rest. Now this is gonna be, we've done this a little bit before, okay? This is your recovery here. All right, we have about 10 minutes left. So if you can only go around, that's fine. If you can only stay in the middle, it's fine. It's you do what's best for you. But our goal is gonna be to try to juggle that same pattern with the figure eight and not let the ball touch the ground. It can be high, it can be low, it can be right, it can be left. Okay, so our goal is going to be to move with the ball. Okay, in that figure eight, if you drop it, Pick it up again, okay? And it's gonna be hard when you turn the angles, okay? Come around, same exact <coughs> pattern, okay? Now, if it's hard, just try, as long as box goes, just try to keep the ball up. Nice and easy juggles in one spot. If you wanna make it a bit difficult, try to just go around this middle cone And back okay all three are good just a little bit to get work on your touch bobs gets one try to go around in the figure eight we do it all together. okay on your march hit set go good this is her weak foot she keeps it, good, keep going. Good job, Ops. This is live, so if you mess up, you really mess up. Good, keep going. Yes. Good job, oh, oh. All right, well, she shows off and she got it. So, this is just something for fun to do. Sometimes we get so bored juggling, yeah? So, there's no problem when you make different ways to move it to go and then you set yourself in talent so if you could only do 10 next week you do 12 or try to go you know just in a different way as possible if you want to just do that okay set yourself in ways you can and also just a hint for me when you for example i could do the parkour now but for me it's now the goal to make it more controlled you know on some edges i was like really uncontrolled so now my goal is to get more control you want to do it again yes all right, she wants to do it again, and then we're going to add a five-minute little bit of a heartbreak right here. So, go ahead. Let's see if she can do it again. All about control, okay? All about you making the figure eight. Do it on your time. Good. Good job. Chop up. You guys, good job. Keep going. She kept it, finished strong here, good. All right, so for the last five minutes here, we're gonna get your heart rate up. All staying with the same. So you're doing the same thing with your right foot, but you're just gonna stay with your right foot. So you're doing it for 30 seconds. 
So be a bit of work. So you're gonna go as fast as you can around, okay? As fast as you can. Didn't do that right. But when you come here, just go around with your right foot, your last cone, and keep going. And it's a little bit shorter, okay? So you're always gonna go, it doesn't matter which way, but just as quick as you can. There you go. Okay? Right foot, when you come here to the end, go again. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Every time you're at your start cone, it's one point. Okay? Get set. Go. As fast as you can. Use your right foot. That's important. Doesn't matter the direction. Just go as fast as you own can. Good. You're halfway. You're halfway. Come on. One more round. Finish whatever round you are in now. Then you're done. Finish, finish. And rest. Good. 30 second rest. Now you're gonna do it with your other side, left foot. Same exact thing. Okay? So she got three with that. Whatever your round, if it's one, if it's two, if it's four, if it's five, just make sure you finish it. Okay? Starting in, in five seconds. This is the last killer here, yeah? Work through it, make sure you finish. Three, two, one, go. Left foot. Good job. Good job, good job, come on. Left foot, keep working here. Last round here, last round here, let's go. Push it, push it. And stop. You should be breathing a bit, yeah? Okay. Okay, two more left. But you can't guess it. All right? Two, this one, just as fast as you can now. Okay? Moving it, staying forward. Okay? Yep, staying forward. As fast as you can, 30 seconds. You have this one, and then you end with the rolls, and you're done. All right? We're starting in five, four, three, two, one, and go. Good. All about touches. Touch, 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 touch. Good. Keep working. Halfway now. And rest. Okay? Last one. 30 seconds rest. Doing your roll. Okay? So you just want to go as fast as you can. All about control, right? As fast as you can, the rolls. Important to stay low and to get, stay controlled. Okay? Last one here. 30 seconds of work. Ready, set, and go. Good. Great work. 10 seconds. Come on. Give me two more rounds. You'll be at your 30. Good job. One more. 10 seconds left. 10 seconds. Good job, Bob. Good. And rest. Good. So that's that's it for today. I actually went by quick fit quick. Yep. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Okay? It's a lot of different things. But the the most important thing here is that again, you don't go off of what necessarily she can do. She's here for that the ideas and so you can see it live. But it's more to beat your record. Beat your record so next Wednesday when we do the low to high, low to high, you're just a bit better than last time. Exactly. That's also my goal. I'm usually yeah, not that good in the technical stuff, so I also have to train it, and I also will train it ne till next week. So, and again, we always give you just ideas. You can now train a little bit longer and or continue training what we did last week. So, yeah, 
It's just giving ideas here. And having some fun. So stay safe, stay hydrated, okay. and we'll see you, see next, you week. next week. Bye, guys.